Here in this video tutorial, I want to show you the scissor uh, which I'm using. Uh, this is, is a professional scissor, but I'm not using uh, that one. Um, instead, I'm using very light um, school scissor, uh, which I found uh, very appropriate, uh, especially for young kids uh, who are mastering um, uh, their skills. And the professional scissor, it's pretty heavy. Uh, however, this one, uh, the brand is uh, Westcott uh, Clean Art. It's um, the model of the scissor. It's created for uh, left or um, uh, right-handed uh, kids for both of them. It's uh, very easy to work with and it's moving um, uh, very uh, smoothly and it's very light. I also have a problem with my um, uh, hand and uh, this uh, scissor is pretty heavy for me but that one it's working uh, so well for me and for my students. And a very important thing, your scissor, you have to uh, dedicate it only for sewing projects. No art, no craft projects, only for sewing. Now I'm going to uh, demonstrate uh, how um, convenient it's uh, this scissor. And I also want to show you an uh, important technique of cutting. When you cut uh, your fabric, um, use the power of the table uh, for support. So how you can see one of the shoulders of my uh, scissor is laying down on the table. Don't tilt the scissor, keep it straight, 90 uh, degree corner and do your cut. Then you're going to have very straight and um, well done uh, cut.